Lane and Julie, in a video posted online this evening, school leaders did not get into exactly what the nature of that threat was, but they say when they found out, they acted quickly. Their goal to prevent the spread of the information from drumming up fear and also to not disrupt the learning process for students and staff. Once we were alerted of the threats, we immediately notified the community and engaged with the Petersburg police so that they could begin their investigation process and implement additional security measures at our schools. And the community was first notified last evening about the threats targeted toward Petersburg High and Vernon Johns Middle Schools. This led to controlled movement at both school campuses today, and officials say there were no issues. Now, throughout the week, students and staff can expect to see more officers and security at both schools. No arrests or charges have been announced, but leaders say they do believe the threats were unfounded. Now, in her message there, the super Superintendent also encouraged parents to talk with their kids about making these kinds of threats and also the importance of speaking up if you have information.